<laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21, a lot of drama going on out there. They saying the game, we tell the story on the other day, they said the game was the top was the top rep in the world in first Elite 3. Some people came out and disputed that, then they said he was boosting. I didn't do no story on that, but Brute had a great story on that yesterday. And then they said yesterday he was cheating in Gold Rush, man. But look, we're going to talk about all that. And then, right after that, some people that, that, was, that said they're the real top reps, they came out and started talking. And as I always say, you can't throw stones if you live in the glass house. And if you got a glass draw, you should... And that's 50. But anyway, y'all understand what I'm trying to say, man. Look, you can't... He who is without sin cast the first stone. Because you already know what time it is, man. Last but not least, YouTube, you got some explaining to do. We're going to talk about all this in the video right after this. Make sure you like the video because it helps me grow. It helps the YouTube algorithm kick out my videos and it gets into recommending and stuff like that. And other than that, man, I appreciate each and every last one of y'all. Gym stars down in the comment section. And let's get right into the video. Nino! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pipes, that shit made me a savage. Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that head. Ooh, don't sound like these smooth transitions, man. Hey, listen, man. Listen. Listen. Yesterday, we uh Friday, I think it was, we did the story talking about the game. And we said that the game was the top rep in the world. And right after that, people came out and said the game was boosting. He's been caught boosting. He's been boosting. All that good stuff, man. Everybody wanted to talk about it. We got videos on YouTube here. I mean, like y'all on Instagram. Look at check this out, man. We got got your boy right here. They're saying that he's in here and he's boosting. And uh, you know, it, it's just with no regard for for what's going on. It's just like like people just throwing him game. Look, bro. And I, like I said, hey, if he could be in on it, but it could be people just want to get in there and throw games for him. Hey, maybe he got a sweatshop of people throwing games for him and all that good stuff. Hey, look there. Let me, y'all answer me this right now. What dollar amount would it take for you to have to go out there and throw games for the game? That's all I'm asking. You you, you, you can make you a new account. He going to give you some VC. You just come out there and throw them games, man. That's what I'm saying. Or is your integrity more important? I, I, I know what my number is. Let me know down in the comment section what your number is, and we'll confer on the next video. What dollar amount would it take for you to come out here and throw games for the game? Because we know he can, he can get people to do it and stuff like that, man. Maybe that's what he got. Maybe he's boosting in, in these other places where everybody been boosting all this time. The only thing I'm saying is, like, y'all act like this is the first time that the top rep has either been boosting or been caught boosting or been accused of boosting or any of that stuff bro we already know what goes on in these back rooms in that back alley when you go into like when you go into the stage itself you know people are cheating you got people playing in comp stage right now they're playing comp stage and they know that they're playing against people that got zins it's just like bro like what what are we doing here? Instead of shunning these people, getting them out of the community and all that, it's like, bro, let me run with you. And this is what happens when you foster this type of thing in a community. This is what happens. You get exactly what you put in. Bad energy in, bad energy out. It's just funny to me because I don't care about none of this stuff. But everybody else just like, yo, do you know people get top rep and it changes their life and blah, 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 yakety smackety. Look, man, let me tell you one thing. The rich get richer. Those who have the wherewithal to do, they're going to do it. Those that don't have the wherewithal to do, they're going to watch you do it and just and get, and look. Is it right that he's cheating? No. But look. Everybody's doing it. You know everybody doing it. You think that every top rep that ever made it, you know what I'm saying, was just doing it legit. They did it 100% legit. They didn't do anything questionable at all. Bro, every every top rep since, what, 17, 16, 17, all that, they, it's been some type of controversy behind it. And we and don't even get me started on gold rush. Bro, come on, man. You know dog on where that these gold rush winners um. What, boot camp winners, gold rush winners, all these other winners that's winning these events? Come on, man. You know these people, other people are boosting. Answer me this question. It's just like with Lance Armstrong. When they said, okay, we're going to strip him of all his titles and we're going to give it to the next person that wasn't cheating, they had to go to like 19 or 20 places down to find the next person that wasn't cheating. The Tour de France is a 23-day race, right? And you losing to Lance Armstrong by five or six minutes. Bruh, you think these people think you're not cheating too? Like, you can't keep up with somebody that's cheating unless you're cheating yourself. 
It seems like people just mad that people cheating better than them. That's how I, that's that's what it really sounds like to me because it's just like when you go to the stage and you watch people play comp stage, you got people literally complaining about people cheesing harder than they're cheesing. It just don't make any sense to me, man. It's it's comical to me cuz I don't I'm, I don't get involved in that. Obviously, if you're in that, if you're trying to be top rep, if you're trying to come up off that scene and all that stuff, I mean, it, it's not comical to you. But it's just like when people take shortcuts on YouTube and you try to grind the right the right way and other people take the shortcuts, it's like, bro, what, what do you expect? You know people, this is the community that we're in. People always do this stuff. It's just how it goes. Is it right? Do I agree with it? No, but we just know that it, it, boy, it's very few, very few 100% legitimate millionaires or people and stuff like that out there. The rich get richer, the poor, the poor just complain about it. That's just how they got us looking right now. It's just like when people strong arm, um, when people strong arm, the, uh, when, when my boy Jay Fox was trying to be top rep and he was going to be top rep and then it was just like he was trying to do it trying to push it by himself or people say I'm doing it by myself and then it came out like Sam found them had the whole had different people playing on the account pushing it to the top just like with the race with Call of Duty they had people playing 24 hours a day on the account of course nobody was going to beat that and then it became an event we're going to do this and we're going to play 24 hours a day until what until we get it like they, they didn't even try to hide it it's like we got several people playing on one account it's the same type of thing but what i'm saying is don't throw stones unless you live um, if you live in a glass house or he who is without sin cast the first stone this is what i was saying me and brood always say if you are one of the people like if you're in second place and you say somebody is cheating and they're in first place and you're right behind them how is it that you're not doing something that's fishy also i'm not saying that he's doing something fishy but pool df which said he was the real top rep and he was he was heading up the, the hashtag ban the game and all that stuff boom look at what he got today pool df 10-4 this account has been has been banned due to a violation of terms of service please contact customer service if you believe this is this happened in there bam there you go like I said, like, does, does he deserve the ban? We don't know at this point in time. All I can tell you is he got banned just now and he was leading up. He was heading up the hashtag ban the game movement. All, all, all I ever be saying is if I was doing something and I was cheating and I didn't, and I thought somebody was ahead of me that was cheating too, I would be as quiet as I could. I would not say anything because I don't want them looking at me because of course they're going to they gonna scrutinize you worse than the game. Is that how it should be? No, but when you got running 2K number and you can FaceTime running 2K and stuff like that, brother, the rules are just a little bit different for you. It just is what it is. Is it right? No, it ain't right. But this is how the real world works and people really mad at this. Like the whole 2K community been cheating in all of these They've been cheating in all of these events. They're cheating in all of this stuff. They're cheating in the stage. they cheating, they got Cronus and Zen. And then it's like, bro, I'm, I'm mad at you for cheating harder or cheesing harder or whatever. People been buying accounts. People been doing this stuff to get top rep and all that. And like, and like now we're all of a sudden surprised, mad about it, all this stuff, man. It is what it is. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Do you think anybody actually has ever won the uh, any of these events uh, legitimately, or do you think that everybody's cheating? I think everybody didn't, didn't, has is either is or did cheat, or they had somebody. If they ain't had a strap, they homeboy around them had the strap. They knew somebody that did have the strap, so maybe they wouldn't kicking and booting people. But bro, we know that that we call it boot camp for a reason because people are getting booted. It's a boot fest. It's this is that. Like we already know what time it is. Like, I don't get why people get so mad about it and just, just get so agitated and stuff, man. Look, we've been knowing it was going on, and now it's just right in front of your face. I get this stuff all the time, people sending me things of people boosting, and it's just like, it just is what it is. It's, just, it's funny as hell to me. It might not be funny to y'all, but it is funny as hell to me, man. And last but not least, YouTube got some explaining to do, man. Check it out, man. Look, you got your boy Joe Noah said, damn, people are so soft, you can't say anything without people getting hurt um, in 2020. It was funny. It was a funny tweet, not offensive at all. And then uh, you know, YouTube came and apologized because they said, uh, "We hear, we we hear you. You're right, and we apologize." Our now deleted tweet was intended in good faith, and yeah, it was just good. It was just supposed to be funny and in, in, in funny this, but uh, but we missed the mark and did not reflect the spirit of the creator community that we love in social media. And this is what they said. This was the actual tweet. This is it. 
the tweet says no one absolutely no one creators after talking for 15 minutes all right let's jump straight into the video now y'all know that youtube links the algorithm to the longer videos you got a video that's over 10 minutes or eight minutes or whatever you can you can do more stuff you can put more ads on it and you can uh and and it it, it hits the algorithm the right way so that you can get more views it pushes the video more once you get to a certain thing everybody knows that about youtube right the thing is the fact that people are getting mad and it's like hit dog holler bro it's funny to me because i already knew what they were talking about and i do it this i do the same thing all the time i used to try to get the videos to go over 10 minutes now i just try to get them to go over eight and a half minutes so i can get i can hit the algorithm right and this channel can try to grow nobody's on youtube to not try to grow you're not on here to just entertain fans and blah 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 all that happy horse stuff that people talk about you on here to put up videos build a fan base and grow most importantly so i get I got the joke. I was like, hey, it's funny as hell to me. But obviously, I'm the only person that got any type of sense of humor in this whole world, man. Like I said, man, the whole thing, everybody's cheating. Everybody's doing everything they can to get ahead, putting the right tags in, all this stuff. How we get mad at other people that are trying to do the same thing? That, I mean, they're doing the same thing that you're doing. That's all I'm saying. I try not to do no underhand tactics, but hey, it is what it is, man. That's what I'm going to be doing the next year. I, I didn't build a play shot this year, but I did build a stretch as soon as I realized my player couldn't shoot. It is what it is, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. You think Game is a reprehensible person? Or do you think the YouTube, I mean, the, the um, 2K community needs to stop? Stop trying to act like they were all angels and, and everybody else doing something wrong with me. And do you think that Pool DF is, uh, is, is guilty? I don't know. He could be. He could be not. I really don't care. I don't care about this current gen, man. We about to move the next gen in a month. I don't see why people sweating so hard to try to get it. But hey, if I was sweating and I was really doing it the right way, I would just be like, eh, he'll get caught, and then that'll be that. But I guess because it's the game, you know, they feel like he don't, he not gonna get caught and they keep trying to ban him, blah, 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 and this and that. It is what it is. Uh, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Do you care? I really don't, but uh, obviously other people do, and I think everybody's cheating, so it just is what it is. It's funny to me that, that people want, that the, the cheaters want other people to get caught cheating, but they wanna remain in obscurity, but it is what it is, man. I'm out of y'all next time, man. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Guys, please.